But I was thinking a little bit on the computer security side of the thing. Yeah. If you feed footage of somebody leaving maybe a briefcase or something and pretending in a way they're gaming this is I think in finance we call it like kiting in transaction, which is you seed this system with small transaction a certain pattern and then you hit it with a big one because it's preceded, yeah. it thinks it's already in pattern and it lets you pass those barriers. And that's always the challenge yeah. of self-learning models. There are ways if it's self-learning where they can kind of do some of that threshold. So similarly in security or computer vision, you could have these already seeding setup right and llm being sitting on the top could potentially detect certain things but again it probably has to be a multimodal custom trained model doing certain things specific ways so here's a question with that model could we teach it to play doom maybe but if we show it enough footage of the doom probably <laughs> it will understand it i think i've seen some of the multimodal llm describing this scene frame by frame and yeah. then well that's how we were playing with those early things at some point i want to come back to those but we were playing with those early where it was playing like street fighter right? that's yeah. it was describing it this Describing a scene probably is a low fidelity, I will call it, or low bandwidth. Like yeah. high fidelity, but low bandwidth, right? So it's going to be able to give you a lot of information. It's just going to be slow to go do it. Possibly, but again, if you're sending a frame through the LLM, it's only going to pay attention to some cool pieces of it. Not everything, but yeah. with at a pixel tracking level, you can see if there's a small enemy sliding in the back, trying to circle you from the back or something. Maybe a CSGO kind of a setup where somebody's hiding and trying to circle you to get to you kind of a setup. They may miss it again maybe because you want to have limited context window where it's paying attention all that stuff but start to mix traditional computer vision with llm could be an interesting setup for sure